Audi boss Fabrizio Longo, 62, killed in 10,000-foot fall while mountain climbing in Italy. A top Audi executive who was an avid mountain climber fell 10,000 feet to his death in a tragic accident just a few miles from the Italian-Swiss border on Sunday, according to reports. Fabrizio Longo, 62, who runs the luxury car company's Italy-based operations, was climbing the Cima Pair in the Adamello Mountains in northern Italy when he fell near the summit, several European-based news outlets reported. Rescue teams rushed to the scene after the accident was witnessed by another climber who called for help. A helicopter team located Longo's body some 700 feet inside a gorge. He was pronounced dead at the scene. His body was transported to the nearby Italian town of Carasolo. Local authorities have launched an investigation. Longo, an expert mountaineer, had reportedly climbed along a route equipped with fixed steel cables, ladders and other aids, according to The Sun. Longo had been the head of Audi's operations in Italy since 2013. He joined the company the previous year. In 1987, he began his career in the automotive industry with Italian carmaker Fiat, where he worked in the marketing department. Fifteen years later, he joined a rival Italian carmaker Lancia. Longo was well known in the winter sports community. The International Ski and Snowboard Federation released a statement mourning his death. Flavio Roda, the head of the federation, called Longo's death, a terrible loss for the federation that has collaborated fruitfully with Longo for years. We join the family in this moment of great pain, and with the staff of Audi Italia, he said.